All right, so the floor is ready for epoxy. We spent the last um, pretty much three days prepping it. My cousin Max is over here helping out uh, for the week. And we rented a grinder. We're doing epoxy on the whole floor except for the grow room, which will be bare concrete. And um, we rented a grinder. We filled the cracks. We kind of messed up. We should have filled the cracks first. If I was to do it again, I would have went and filled the cracks coarse and then done a, a better um, like top coat on top of it because you can see some of it like settles. You can see like right there, there's a, it's, a, it's still recessed a little bit. So we should have done two coats of that and then ground so that's like perfectly level and then clean. Um, with cleaning, we pressure washed it all. We did a little bit of soap and water in some spots where there's oil, but the oil's soaked in pretty deep. So we're gonna have to see how that does. And then um, we're, re we're pretty much ready for paint right now. It's been drying for two days and we just swept and used a leaf blower to get all the, the dust out of here. Here's what we're using. It's a tile clad by Sherwin-Williams, the part A and part B. So you're gonna mix it up and then let it sit for an hour and sweat and then it's ready to, to roll. So we're gonna be rolling right now in, in about 10 minutes. And then um, before we, we started all the final cleaning, we went ahead and measured out all our top and bottom plates. So we got all our lumber out here now. So once the, the paint's down, we can go outside and frame out all of our walls while the paint is curing. So today's Thursday. Thursday we're gonna finish painting the floors and then finish framing that out for the, the lab, which is gonna go right here, and then the incubation, which is gonna go right here. So that'll be done today, the framing. It won't come in yet. And then tomorrow, what we can do is we can have light traffic on here and we will come in and do the spawn lab and the spawn incubation framing. And then on Saturday will be the day that we're gonna drag, that'll be over 24 hours after it's been put down, the epoxy. We'll go ahead and drag all the framing in. So, and we already have a lot of the electrical pulled, but we're not putting the walls up yet, so I can pull more electrical if I need, but most of the, the wires are done. You can see there's, a, we got a bunch of 10 gauge, a bunch of 12 gauge all ran out. I'm gonna have a 20 amp 10 gauge for each air conditioner unit, each two ton, two ton, two ton, two ton, and then there's also gonna be a one ton on that as well. Gonna have two units in the fruiting room. So yeah, um, gonna have some more videos coming up pretty soon on other stuff that I got. And uh, yeah, I'm really excited. So let me get back to it. Let me go ahead and, and finish painting, or fin start painting rather. And uh, hope, hope you like this video. If you wanna see more videos like this, patreon.com supports me, encourages me to keep doing more videos. And it funds me to where I can experiment more and play around more and you'll see some, some of the cool experiments I'll be working with in the next coming weeks. I'm gonna have multiple sterilizers to show you guys how to build all of them. So yeah, hope you like this. Keep on mushrooming, myersmushrooms.com. Check it out. Have a good one, later.